All right, here we are in uh, electronics, third term with uh, yet another Arduino project. Today we are looking at uh, Mr. Santiago's version of a digital voltmeter. So you want to provide a brief explanation of uh, how this works? Uh, basically, the Arduino takes a reading from the power supply and then writes the voltage amount to the seven segment LEDs. Um, pretty much it, the voltage reading is an analog reading. Uh, the numbers, of course, from the seven segment are digital uh, displays. Okay, so this is what we're measuring. This is the voltage that we're measuring, right? Right. And what powers this up then? Is that powered up through this? So this isn't powered up through the supply, right? No. It's powered up separately. So as I adjust this, then that reading should change. Is that what? That's correct. What should happen? All right. Let's see if that happens. It's kind of hard to see on the video because the segments are a little bit funny. But you can see, what does it say now? 31, 32, 39, somewhere in there, and we can crank it up. 5.6, 4.4, 4.3. So it gives us the, the DC voltage there, which is pretty cool. Okay, and then the other thing that we wanted to uh, show our studio audience today is this little pot here. Can you explain what that does? Basically, I set up the pot so that um, the segments themselves will display the numbers at either a faster rate or a slower rate. Um, right now, it appears as if they're both on. Okay. And if I turn the pot down, you will see that the numbers will start to blink back and forth. Which they are. The further I go, the slower they will blink as I turn the pot down. Okay. So you're really only showing one digit at a time. Right. Right? And the advantage of that, of course, is that uh, you're only using the current required to display one digit at a time, which saves on your battery if you're running it off a battery or just makes it uh, makes it use less power overall. So we've added this just to show the people that are watching that what a multiplex display is, that this actually uh, is displaying one then the other one, but when we crank it up, our eyes, the, the, our, our uh, retinas in our eyes don't respond as quickly as the display does. So from our perspective, it looks like it's on pretty much all the time. Can you turn it up a little more here? Uh, the, the chip that's actually doing this, which is this fellow right here, uh, he's not the fastest chip out there, so that's why the display looks a little bit jittery. That looks really good right now. You've got it right about at its, uh, at its sweet spot. So what they've done is they've taken an Arduino, hooked it up through some proprietary circuitry of their own design, and they have made a digital voltmeter that is capable of reading from, what is it, 0 through 9.9 volts? Yep. So it can read just about up to 10 volts. So awesome. Another A project from, uh, from Landon's third term lab. Congratulations. Thank you. Nice job. All right.